An urgent health alert on that measles outbreak sweeping the country right now. The CDC saying doctors are diagnosing nearly 100 new cases of measles every week in the U.S. More than 500 people in 20 states have gotten the virus this year alone. And we've got a lot of questions about it. Joining us with some answers is Dr. Maline Desai with Patient First. Doctor, thank you for being here. Thank you. All right, let's first talk about Virginia. Not one of the states affected right now. Correct. But things can spread very quickly with measles. Very quickly. It's a highly contagious virus. Yeah. Uh, not all that different from the contagiousness of the flu. Okay. Um, and it's spread sim uh, similarly the same way by respiratory uh, droplets, coughing, sneezing. Okay. Um, the symptoms themselves, what, what are we talking about here? So typically the symptoms start with a very high fever. Okay. Uh, we see 104, 105, uh, not uncommon. Yeah, okay. um, afterwards, we get what we call the three C's. You, know, you get a uh, cough, coryza, which is a fancy name for brain nose, and conjunctivitis, uh, just redness, irritation in the eyes. About four days later, you can expect to develop the classic rash. Starts up in the hairlines, uh, red flat rash, and it uh, spreads down to the neck, to the arms, to the body. Okay, the three C's, that's important. So uh, let's talk about vaccination. There is available a booster for adults, do they know that? There is a vaccine that you can get as a child, uh, which is your t part of your typical childhood vaccines. Okay. Uh, there, if you're found to be non-immune, and you can talk to your doctor about finding out if you're immune or not, or if you don't know based on your records, uh, you, there is a vaccine adults can get as well, okay. uh, uh, which is a series of shots. What's the first thing, if we think we have the measles, what's the first thing that we should do? Uh, contact your your provider, Co okay. contact your physician, find out if you are truly vaccinated tr or find out if you're truly immune to measles. Uh, there are, uh, your doctor will then instruct you how to uh, get seen. Obviously they don't, if they truly believe you have measles, they don't want you to come into the office and spread it. Uh, so they'll instruct you the correct ways of uh, getting tested for it. Quickly, are there any things we can do just every day to prevent? Of this course, uh, same thing you would do with the flu, you know, good hand washing cover up when you're sneezing, uh, find out about your uh, immunity status, um, and uh, uh, just talk with your, your physician in regards to that. All right, Dr. Maline Desai, thank you so much for being here. We appreciate it. Thank you.